Hey, what's up guys? I am on my way to the town league that's happening today. Apparently my registration for it got successful, so I am part of today's town league. I am trying to find a shop. It's over at Peace Centre, which is where I am right now. I think it's on the third floor. I've never been to it. It's called Cavdeen Den. Let's just find it and see how it is. Also, I am not sure how prepared I am. I have made quite a few changes to my deck and I don't know if that's a smart move to do because I've not tested my deck with those changes. God, am I tired. Alright, I'm just going to try to find a shop first and I'll check in with you guys in a second. I see a unit with tables and I think the shop itself is at the back there. Yeah, Cap Dean's then. So I found a place. Still a bit early, but I guess I'll just check in and wait. Hi, I'm here for the town league today. Uh, yeah, yeah, can, uh, just give me a while to check this okay. Alright, I just went through my deck check and registration. One thing to point out, which I just learned today, is that if you're gonna double sleeve, double sleeve everything. So yeah, uh, that was my mistake. I only double sleeve the more pricier cards that I had just to protect them. But yeah, now my deck has been run to just purely single sleeving. Yeah, now I just gotta wait, I guess, because there's still plenty more players to be registered. I don't think I'll be updating throughout the entire thing. I'll just try to check in in between matches and update you whether I win or lost. I'll do my best to get as much footage as I can. Wish me luck and let's just see how it goes. Also, I don't think I mentioned this, but the deck I'm using for today's tournament is the Palkia Intellion, which is a deck that's been doing really well. Even for me, and I don't really like using meta decks to begin with. But yeah, just going with that one. Hopefully it goes well. So yeah, I'm still just waiting for everyone to be registered and then we can begin. It's gonna take a while. I'm trying to see who I'm going up against. Uh, we are slightly more than halfway through. I'm gonna be completely honest, it's not going too well. I've been through four games right now, and my current score is 1 3, which means I've lost three matches. In fact, I lost the first three matches, which was a huge letdown, but yeah, it is what it is. So, we still have two more games to go, so hopefully, those go well. But to be honest, at this point, I'm just playing for the fun of it. I don't really care anymore if, whether I win or lose. So, yeah, let's just see how the next two games go. I am back home now. Super tiring day, but I had plenty of fun. So just to give you an update on the final score, by the end of the total of six matches, my final score was 3-3. Lost the first three matches that I played, but luckily the remaining three matches that I played managed to win them. I was feeling pretty frustrated for the first three games because it was just not going as well as I'd hoped. Overall, I still had plenty of fun. The had a good time meeting people that I knew from Toys Terminal and as well as people that I started to connect with online. And yeah, just the overall experience of this town league, I would say it's a really fruitful one. This was my first time ever joining an official Pokemon tournament, aside from the world's qualifiers that I tried for which did not go too well. I'm just glad that COVID restrictions have loosened up enough for us to have events like these and I hope to see more happen in the future and I would really love to join more in the future as well. As for future town leagues, I might try play a couple more down the line. I don't think I'll try for each and every one of them, but I'll try play more. I don't know if I'll still continue playing the Palkia deck that I played today. I saw quite a few interesting decks that weren't in the meta, so I might try play something a little bit different if I were to get into another town league in the future. Also, they give you two packs for each person that registered. It was either a choice between Astro Radiance or Fusion Strike. And I've mentioned this quite a number of times in other videos where I'm really burned out from Astral Radiance. So, I got two packs of Fusion Strike. And they also had a mystery door gift. Let me go grab it from my bag. I put it in my deck box. So yeah, they even gave this. I think it's like a V card. You can see the label for the Town League over here. That's actually pretty cool. I kind of would want to keep that actually. Okay, got it unsealed. Let's see what the card is. 
I don't know, there's like two cards, front and back, I don't know which is which. Oh. Ooh, okay. That's pretty cool, so I got a Zigzagoon, a Reverse Holo Zigzagoon, Galarian Zigzagoon, which is a very playable card. Got an Inteleon V. I don't know if I, I think I might have one or two of these. As well as a Reverse Holo Charizard from River Voltage. And of course, the two Fusion Strike packs, you know what, let's just open it now. So two packs of Fusion Strike. Okay, one, two, three, four. Let's just see what's in it. Let me stand over here instead. Alright, okay. Fighting Energy, Pangoro, Graplocked, Hamburger Bunny, Meltan, Toxo. Ooh, nice. Staryu, Mawile, Makuhita, a Reverse Holo Skarmory, and the last card is Pelosand, non holographic. Alright. Nothing there, let's just see what's in pack number two. We have a Gengar pack. Okay, one, two, three, four. Let's see what's inside this one. We have a Lightning Energy, Lopani, Hariyama, Breloom, Makuhita, Panpaw, Soweto, Skarmory, Jinx, a Reverse Holo, Excelgo, and the last card is an Arcanine non holographic. Alright. And I think that will pretty much wrap up this video for me. Hopefully you you guys enjoyed watching me talk about my thoughts going through the Pokemon Town League. I do apologize that this is a much shorter video than I'd hope it to be. There's like quite a lack of footage from my end. But the thing is, I wanted to focus up during the matches and not get too caught up with trying to get footage and all that. So, But more importantly, I just wanted to give my thoughts on going through this whole thing and hopefully it was interesting to you and again if i do take part in more down the line i might try to do a better job of filming that so yeah uh hopefully you guys enjoyed watching this and i'll catch you guys in the next one peace